And finally tonight, construction work on a house in England has unearthed new information on the secret lives of Catholics during the Reformation. The project at the house in Norfolk unearthed handwritten manuscripts and other materials dating from the 15th and 16th centuries. Officials say the objects confirm the history of the house as a retreat for a devout Catholic family. Luke Copen, Europe editor for Catholic News Agency, joins us now from London. Luke, welcome back. Good to see you. So what can you tell us about the artifacts that were uncovered and why are they so significant? Well, researchers have made some absolutely amazing discoveries in this house. Um, the star find is probably a 15th century uh, manuscript parchment. Uh, which is beautifully illuminated with gold leaf and bits of blue. Uh, and this was just discovered quite randomly by a builder who just noticed the glint of the gold leaf. Um, and it, experts believe that this manuscript may have been part of uh, a book of hours, which was um, a devotional book that was used by many lay people at the time. Um, they also found, uh, quite incredibly, uh, an almost completely intact copy of a book called The King Psalms. And this book's really interesting because it was written by St. John Fisher, who was famously executed after he refused to recognize King Henry as the head of the church in England. Um, we should also mention as well some uh, little fragments that they found of handwritten musical notation. And these are really interesting because they think that these uh, may have been used by musicians um, who attended secret masses at the hall that were celebrated uh, after the Reformation, even though it was illegal to do so. What an amazing discovery. Do we have any idea who the family was? Yes, we, we know uh, a fair bit about the family uh, who were the Beddingfields. Uh, they experienced a quite incredible rise and fall uh, during the Tudor era. They were very prominent at the royal court uh, until the Reformation truly arrived, uh, at which point they refused to abandon their Catholic faith. Uh, and as a result, they were ostracized from the court uh, and they face all sorts of penalties and persecution over the next few centuries. Luke, is it unusual for discoveries like this to be made when houses are being renovated? Yes, it is. Um, what's so rare about it is that archaeologists very, uh, it's very seldom that they have the chance to go digging around in uh, areas of these houses which haven't been uh, disturbed for centuries. Um, and I think also as well, what they found is very significant for English Catholics uh, because it's a reminder of just how much uh, families like the Beddingfield sacrificed to keep the faith alive during really the darkest period uh, for Catholics in this country. Well, Luke, thank you so much for sharing that with us. We really appreciate it. Luke Hopin, Europe Editor for Catholic News Agency. Thanks again, Luke. Thank you, Tracy.